Today I am going to talk to you about tying six different types of knots. To start off, I'm going to use a single knot, followed by a double knot, then by a Pratt, a four and a hand, half Windsor, and then full Windsor. Along with that, I will be using the different types of collars, which are appropriate for the different types of knots. Right now, I'm wearing a pinpoint collar. In my other sequels, I will be using a butterfly collar and then a spread collar. For this pinpoint collar, you want to use a single knot or a double knot. As I'm about to tie a single knot, you want your short end on your left side and your long end on your right side. By pulling out your left end first, you want to have it at 180 degrees on the right, going from behind the left end. Then you'll have it come across the front. And coming up from behind is the big end coming through. The big end you will have put in this hole. And then tighten your knot by pulling on the smaller end, which is the left. And so the long end will be in the front. Now you have made a single knot tie. Also with the single knot and with the pinpoint collar, which is the only collar that you can use for the, what I'm about to show. This here is a collar bar. A collar bar is only used with closed collars and small knots. As I will show right here, this is how the collar bar works. As you can tell, the knot pops out to make you more pronounced in front of others. Others will notice, notice you more with using a collar bar. You can also use a tab bar or a barbell pin with different types of collars. Thank you.